So you spend a lot of time preparing this beautiful video for your students and you start to present it in your Microsoft Teams meeting and then the video lags and distorts. Can you imagine what you and your students will be going through in that Teams meeting? Hey, my name is Bhavani Kola. Welcome back to my channel. In today's session, I will be showing you a quick and easy way to present your YouTube videos in your Teams meeting without lagging or distorting and also including the audio. So without a further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So here I am in my Teams meeting. Let me go ahead and talk to you about what happens when you share your screen and then share your video. So if your video is hosted on YouTube, it has to come from YouTube Cloud to your desktop, from your desktop to Teams Cloud or Office 365 Cloud, and from there to your audience. So it has a couple of stops to make. So that's why your video is distorted or it's lagging. Let me go ahead and show you the easiest way to share your video. So let me go ahead and close this. So here I am on my PowerPoint web. I'm going to go ahead and start a new blank presentation. And here I am on a blank new presentation. And I'm going to click on Insert tab. And when you move all the way to the right here, you have an option of inserting an online video. So you are using the link from your YouTube and you're plugging it in here and it's automatically embeds inside your PowerPoint. That way, when you play the video, the video is being played from the YouTube platform or YouTube cloud and there's going to be absolutely no distortion. So let me go ahead and click on online video. I'm going to paste the YouTube link that I want my students to see. Definitely, I want them to know how to convert a Word document into PowerPoint. I'm going to click insert. And once it's here, I'm going to reorganize it or resize it. And there I have it. One thing I want to mention is when you click on insert an online video, here you have an option of sharing your YouTube, SlideShare, Venmo, and Stream. I did have some difficulty with my stream videos. I could not play them in my Microsoft Teams when I had to embed them in my PowerPoint. So it might be because of the permissions. I highly recommend playing your stream video in your Teams before you start your class. But if you have a YouTube video, that's easy peasy. And as you can see, it's automatically in my presentation. Once that's done, I want to go ahead and rename the presentation to best way to present. Why not? Right now, once this is done, let me go back to my team's meeting. I'm going to click on the share button here and here. I should see the best way to present. I'm going to click on it. And again, you will be streaming this directly from YouTube. So there's going to be absolutely no lag. Whatever you see is exactly what your students will be seeing. And you also have an option to play and stop it whenever you want. As you can see, the video is playing perfectly without any lag. And the best part is while your video is playing, you can use all these annotation tools as well. Isn't that cool? I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something new today. If you did, please make sure you like and subscribe. And if you think it's worth sharing, please go ahead and do so because you know there are educators who are struggling to share the YouTube videos while using Microsoft Teams meeting. And did you know we now have a Facebook page where you can connect with me and exchange more educational thoughts. And do not forget to check out the Teaching with Teams playlist in the description box below. And always remember, happy teaching and please take care of yourself.